a lot of the jobs and a lot of the work in this town are kind of behind desks. I needed something more tactile. I needed something to make. I needed to, to actually be building things and, and get my hands dirty at the end of the day. I haven't had sponsors throughout the years. Skateboarding is really my thing. Now that I'm not skating as hard as I used to, it's kind of one of those things where I'm actually, you know, trying to look at the other side of things and trying to upcycle some of the boards that we kind of go through in our community. Now more than ever, I'm always just kind of tinkering with making different things, but paddles have kind of been the sticking product for sure and the best seller. Going from, you know, wanting to get my hands dirty to full on, you know, now this is like my 40th, 50th paddle I'm selling, you know, it's, it's quite incredible and it's awesome. We still definitely are a smaller town, or a smaller city to a certain degree, but everyone's really starting to open their eyes a bit to a lot of the amazing things that are working. And, and we're not like, you know, a local town anymore. We're really starting to grow our wings to a certain degree and, and really learn and push ourselves. I think that's the amazing part. I'm Andrew Zito, and we're at the Ottawa City Woodshop. Uh, I make things out of recycled skateboards. <laughs>